Darren, obviously a really disappointing result the other night. Have you had the reaction that you wanted even from at training today? We didn't do a huge amount of training, in all fairness. We've we, we done a little bit of training um, because of playing 120 minutes on Saturday on a heavy, boggy pitch. Um, and then the training pitches are, are, are the same as well. So we've done a little bit of work on it, but we've had a very productive meeting. Um, things have been said, I believe they're uh, spoken openly and honestly. Um, no excuses. There's there's absolutely no excuses for Saturday. Um, we we seriously underperformed, <clears throat> but what we've had to do as a as a group of players and and as staff is get it out in the open, turn the page and move on because there's not a great deal of sort of thinking time because we've got another big game to consider. So let's hope that. It was as productive as I hope it was. The meeting and the, and the little bit of work we've done, and we can we can get ourselves back on track with a certainly a performance that is more like what we've been showing of late. So that is such positive, <coughs> have such quick turnaround into what is a really important game that means a lot to the fans as well. It means a lot to the fans. Means a lot to myself and the players. We kind of we we we. I certainly feel like I owe people after Saturday. I hope the players feel the same. Um, but what I'm going to do now is not talk about it anymore yeah. because Saturday's gone. That's that's how we that's how we finish the meeting today. Unfortunately, you know we've 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 got to, we've got to move on from it. Um, and when we put that game to to one side and and look at our recent form in in the league and how we've been going and and the obvious opportunity that we find ourselves in in the league with these games in hand there's still plenty to play for so our focus is very much on the next league game which which happens to be a massive local derby as well um and we need to we need to put right what we didn't do on saturday and hopefully turn tuesday into three points in terms of a performance what are you most hoping to see from your team tomorrow night um <clears throat> Listen, what they, they, they've shown many attributes over this recent run of games where we've been good. Um, we've showed defensive qualities, we've showed good attacking qualities, we've moved the ball around well, uh, we looked, we've been hard to beat. So there's been many attributes that has contributed to that run and we need to just get back to that. The one that concerns me the most is being able to play the game that I want us to play. Um, I've tried to build a belief and a philosophy over the last 14, 15 months of how I want the team to play in um, various different shapes. But unfortunately, the pitch is not going to be conducive with how I want to play. But we have to show a different string to our bow and, and adapt to the, to the perform, um, should I say, the, the pitch, um, certainly in home games. So we might have to tweak our tactics slightly. Um, it's not something I want to do, but it's something that we have to do. What would your message be to the fans? Because obviously they're going to play such a big part in a game that they care about a lot and their their support is going to be vital tomorrow. It's always vital. I mean, it, it's obviously raised for, for a local derby, but their support is always crucial. You know, they, they've followed us up and down the country and they'll, they'll be right behind us for these remaining 14 games. Um, and that all starts tomorrow night with a local derby. So I hope, I hope that they can refocus themselves as well. You know, it, it was a disappointing day on Saturday, but hopefully they can refocus as well. Look at these last fourteen games and realise what is potentially in front of us if we if we finish the season strong. Get back to getting right behind the boys again in the league campaign, and. We was all in a really good place, rowing in the same direction. And let's just make sure Saturday was a blip and we're all back together again on Tuesday, supporting each other.